Hey guys, as we are closing towards the next Nothing smartphone launch, which is the budget segment E series, which can be a Nothing Phone 2A, the Nothing Phone 2 price is officially being dropped by 5,000 rupees, and right now it's available for the price of 40,000 rupees officially on Flipkart. Now let's take a reason why you should consider now buying the Nothing Phone 2 at a price of 40,000 rupees, and you can also get the phone price even lower with the card discounts as well. Now very first, the phone indeed does look, still looks premium and it's a head turner smartphone as the phone comes with the premium glass and metal frame built and it also has the glyph interface which is unique till date. We have also done a phone complete review which you can also check out the card in the description uh, above or link in the description below for the nothing phone to our in-depth review. Now, not only that, the phone also comes with a wireless charging IP54 water and dust resistance, which you also won't be finding this in the other budget segment, in the other smartphones in this budget segment. Also, the OnePlus 11R was a good contender for this phone, but considering that nothing phone 2 is available at the price, then it is the overall better option to go with. Not only that, the camera of the nothing phone 2 is indeed good enough as it comes with a 50 megapixel of a primary camera and also the secondary camera is of 50 megapixel which is the ultra wide camera. You can shoot 4K at 30 or 60 FPS, there is not support for 8K video resolution and it also comes with OIS support as well. Now the selfie camera is a 32 megapixel in this phone so which is again a decent selfie camera, it takes a good enough pictures and the storage capacity comes with multiple options starting from 8 plus 128. The phone processor is still a good to go as it comes with the Snapdragon 8 Plus Gen 1 which was the flagship processor for the last year and we are also right around the corner for the Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 so it won't be a much of an issue. Now talking about the front of the phone which is the display then the phone also comes with LTPO panel and a 1 billion color option 120Hz of high refresh rate which is adaptive obviously so it's a great addition to have in your phone at this price segment as well. Overall the only thing which might be a bit of a concern for some of you is about its software support. Now, the thing is said to be receiving 4 years of security patch updates but there are still chances that the phone will still be receiving till the 2-3 to three years of software upgrades only. Now comparing it with the other smartphone manufacturer at this price point, this is compared to a year less but overall you have to sacrifice with that for the better overall in hand experience with the phone when comp and sacrificing for its software. Now what do you think about this phone, will you consider buying the nothing phone too or not? Let us know your thoughts in the comment section below and I'll see you in the very next one. Thanks for watching.